President Buhari marks Eid El Kabir with pauper serving in Katsina, speaks on importance of NYSC but silent on ministers' certificate scandal. President Mohamedou Buhari has spoken on the need for Nigerians to take part in the National Youth Service NYSC, but continued to maintain silence over the revelation that his minister skipped the mandatory program and obtained a fake exemption certificate. A Premium Times investigation showed that Finance Minister, Kemi Adeosan, failed to serve despite graduating before the age of 30. The minister obtained a forged discharge certificate afterwards, when she was apparently not entitled to one. Over 44 days after the revelation, the minister has refused to react to the scandal. The federal government has also failed to address the matter. On Tuesday, however, while celebrating Salah in Daura, his hometown, Mr. Buhari said his support for the scheme remains unchanged. The president, after prayers, received members of the NYSC serving in Daura community an audience that has become part of his schedule during the Salah celebrations in the past years. While reaffirming his support for the scheme established in 1973, Mr. Buhari told the core members that, it is better to know all about the country than for people to be state-inclined. I always look forward to meeting the NYSC team because I served mostly in the South when I was in the military. He said that during his military career that many people did not know much outside their immediate environment. For them, NYSC members to be brought to the desert and near the Sahel region is a very difficult thing but it will make an impact on Nigeria. I have personally spoken to Jen Gowen to thank him for having the initiative to start the NYSC program. It is very good for Nigeria, the president also welcomed the core members to the ancient town of Daura and asked them to enjoy their service year. In his remarks, the core liaison officer, Jibran Ishik, thanked the president for prioritizing the welfare of the youth to secure their future through his style of leadership and developmental initiatives. The voice of the people is the voice of God and by the grace of God, we pray that in 2019 you will continue to be president of Nigeria to do more for us, Mr. Ishik said. Mr. Buhari also expressed delight over Nigeria's steady progress toward food sufficiency. The president made his feelings known when he fielded questions from reporters at his private residence in Daura. He thanked Almighty God for a bumper harvest being recorded across the country. I hope the rainy season will be as good as the previous ones so that there would be plenty of food so that we may even completely stop importation of food items, he added. The president wished all Nigerians a happy and successful celebration and expressed delight that the country was spending less on food importation. According to him, the development is a major boost to the agricultural policies of his administration. On the mammoth crowd chanting back quotes I Baba, on his way back home after performing the Eid El Kabir prayer at Jaurid Ground, the president said he did not expect anything less from his immediate constituency. I am very happy about it, the warm reception, and I do not expect anything less from my immediate base, he said. Think your friend would be INTRESTED. Share this story using any of the share button below down arrow place your text advert below greater than 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 loading. Share your story with us via email, info at 247nigerianewsupdate.co Receive news via our WhatsApp, kindly text 234,701056-0394-2 Add, you, click, here, to, join, us, on, our, YouTube, channel, 4, news, update, click, here, to, join, us, on 
Twitter for instant news update, at 247NGNEWSUPDAT. Click here to join millions around the globe to read news on our Facebook fan page for instant updates on Instagram. Click here receive instant news update via our BBM broadcast, D3DEFDF.